So the focus will be on the head, hand in, and the legs up to the wall. Okay. Hi, I'm Coach Victor. Welcome to another video. Today I'm going to teach you how to glide and glide very well. I'm doing this for those who may be struggling, those who are not struggling, and for beginners. Getting it well or your set off is very important to your glide. So you must be sure you get it right. Now, always be sure your hands are straight. Now remember, there's weight in your elbows. So when you are gliding, be sure your hands are all straight, both hands. And there's weight in your knees. So by all means, you be sure you don't bend your knees, else it will slant you down. If you bend your elbow as this, when you are gliding, it will tilt your body. That means you do that 360 kind of thing. But we want to avoid that. So we want to get the arms straight and correct, and the legs well to the wall, and not bending our knees. Now, I'm going to start with taking breath into my mouth, put my head in. Now, see what's going to happen. When I put my head in, I'll lock my head with my biceps. And you feel, you will look, you see the water. I want to bring my middle section up. So I'm going to do that first. Watch it this way. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. Good. So we leverage on this to get our legs to the wall so that our set of can be good. So I'm going to do this like two, three times. So watch. One. Two. Three. Now let's work on the legs. Really, really focus on the legs. Now, Two key places to look at. The head in, the legs up. So I'm going now. This is how the legs start the wall. Easy. Right. I'm going to do it one more time and I glide with it or I push with it. I'm going now. All right. Now I'm gliding. Now, gliding simply means staying afloat on the surface of the water, on a streamlined and a very balanced position. I'm going to go now. Now, there's a question. Should I hold my breath throughout the gliding or exhale throughout the gliding? That is to your own discretion, they say. <laughs> so you can hold your breath throughout. When your hand touches the wall, then you exhale. Or you can exhale throughout in the water so you get to the end. That makes it easy when you get out. You just bring your head up. But the purpose of the exhaling also is so that when you come out, you don't have you panting and doing... <sighs> Or have water in your nose because if you don't exhale and you come out, they feel like there's a little bit of debris of water right here. And if you're not careful, you do it will go into your nose. So we want to avoid that. So let me do that last gliding, and then I will fusing my student who is behind the camera <laughs> to do his gliding. All right, I'm going now. Ready? Be sure your, your, your push is solid. Okay. Uh, and let your legs come up a bit high before you push. One, two, go. Legs up and push. Legs straight back. Legs straight back. Legs straight back. Good. Legs straight back. Remember. Be sure your legs are straight back. Okay. Your body will be losing balance but it's normal okay. all right one two three go push nice leg straight back 
Head down well. Right. So I see where the problem is. Don't worry. Leg straight. Leg straight. Leg straight. Just keep your leg straight. Keep your leg straight and close. Nice. Was that good? Yes, but I think I delayed you locking my hand. Your hand. Okay, that's fine. One, two, three. Go. Nice one. Alright, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like and share. See you in the next video.